Your former sins no longer define your existence. Christ does now. And this is why all of us must constantly be obeying Paul's command. In light of that fact, Paul says in Romans 6, 11, reckon yourselves to be dead to sin. Consider yourself to be dead to sin, but alive to God in Christ Jesus our Lord. Don't look at yourself as some identity of some sin. Consider yourself to be dead to sin. Don't let sin reign in your mortal body that you should obey it in its lusts. Now that's easier said than done, obviously. But this is why the Christian life is described as a war in which we are soldiers. We war against the world, Satan, our own remaining sin, our evil desires that we have. Our final victory over sin will only be ours when we are resurrected and glorified in heaven. And what a wonderful day that will be, won't it? In Romans 8, 24, Paul said, we were saved in this hope 